Greetings and welcome back to Factorio. I'm Catherine of Sky, and I have done a little bit of uh, building just over here um, in building the green circuit array. A few of you have mentioned this and I absolutely love the feature where you can copy one entity and then click and drag to copy it to all the rest. Um, that's so, so much fun, I think. Um, also, I wanted to tell you guys that I have added the map exchange string. It's in the description below. I have also gone and um, I have added a ton of blueprints to my Google Drive. Uh, and basically those are all in kind of like text files and I wanted to show you those. They are right here. Uh, and basically they, I have sorted them by name because Google is really funny about how you do folders for some reason. Um, so I've added like defense, wall long, wall short, green circuits, um, early game, like mining, we've got power, lots of rails and stations as well. So I've added a lot of these from, from the Belt Diva series, from the SpaceX series, a lot of the, uh, the blueprints that I'm going to use. I have not added many of the production type stuff because as we're seeing in um, this game, <laughs> production is very funky. So I might choose to put those in a different way um, or whatever, but this, the green circuits that is in there, um, is in that folder and I should actually should rename it to something like, you know, um, extended, uh, recipes or what is it called? Expanded or no expensive. That's the word expensive recipes. <clears throat> so anyway, I think that's a lot of fun. A few of you have mentioned the map things to me. And what I really love is this is actually map view. I am in map view. I can zoom around the whole factory this way. Uh, and guess what, guys? You can also make blueprints from the map view, which I think is very, very cool. I am still in map view. I can make a whole blueprint. This is going to be fantastic for doing things like solar arrays and plopping them down wherever you want to. I could put this green circuits, these green circuits right over here if I want to, uh, and then possibly get robots to build it for me. So that is a really, really awesome feature. And uh, so anyway, I think... What I'm going to do is I'm going to change them all around a bit, uh, but I'll do that off camera because I tend to like my own mall design um, a little bit better. And also this one is, um, it's been modified by a couple of different people uh, as far as I know. So this isn't the original uh, mall design that uh, Mike came up with, just to be clear on that. So what I would like to do today is get some of the military science packs made because I, we're going to need them. Oh, I've run out of research. Dear me. That's not good. How can that be? Yeah, we're, let's go with, yeah, red green is good because we have nothing else. So I've gone and looked at, oh my gosh. And we, do we have grenades yet? Probably not. Oh, I did make some, didn't I? Oh, I do have some. Let's make some more. Just pocket craft things for a minute. Pardon my pocket crafting, right? Okay, let's get... Oh, and I've run out already. Good gracious. I don't like running out of these things. It's very annoying. Because then we're going to have to resort to tree cutting, and that's just totally unacceptable. Let's go ahead and get these guys sorted. <clears throat> There's another two. Do I have enough materials? I need coal. All right, let's go up here. I think we're going to need a coal belt. I think we are. All right. So let me go ahead and, and do that, because I think... We're going to need to make grenades for the military science packs. So let's just take this up this way. Uh, and get some coal. All right, we can kind of, we can pilfer it or we can just get another line. I think it's probably safer if we just grab another line of coal. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to split off right here. just so that we make sure, and it's not dependent on, you know, other things. Let go, oh, no, all right, fine. Okay, there we go. Let's see, whoa, 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 hold on, hold on. Let's get batteries, that's a good research to have. Okay, so we're going to have another... We should get more copper smelting going, I think. 
So this is all for coppery stuff. Let's make this one then for coal. I might be leaving too much space, but it's better to have more space than not enough, I would dare say. Okay, I think we'll get this smelting up and running so that we can have more copper because we're clearly, we clearly need it. I mean, we're not, we don't have a surplus of copper. It is being used, all of it's being used. And as we produ um, increase production of green circuits and stuff like that, uh, we're going to need it even more. Okay, let me grab my... Do I have a, my smelting array? No. That's labs. No, I don't want that. I don't want that either. That's labs. I don't care about that. Alright, I'm just going to use reuse one of my reusable blueprints. These uh, <laughs> blueprints are very interesting. The ones that... Um, we can't find a way to delete as of yet. Of course, by the time you see this episode, maybe they will already be deletable. I don't know. But I wish they were just simple deletable. Because right now, they're driving me crazy. There's just always too many in the inventory. And I feel like... I guess I could make a chest and shoot it. But eh. It's not ideal, for sure. Okay. Go that way, please. Nice. Nice. Oh, and thank you guys for giving me suggestions on some of the mods that you'd like to see in a modded series. Uh, I'm very much looking forward to doing that once the, um, the mod makers finish updating the mods because apparently the code is quite different and there are some problems that need to be overcome. So I am looking forward to that time. But in the meantime, I am really loving playing vanilla. I, I, am always, I have always loved vanilla gameplay in this particular game. And uh, so I'm just enjoying it like crazy. All right, come on, come on. Build things. Build stuff. Aw, oh, didn't work there. All right. <clears throat> so we have, it looks like we've got these two miners. Why are they not working? Okay, this one has run out. Hi, Gates. How you doing? This one is gone. This one, I think the problem with this one is it's literally full. Okay, so we'll take that one off for now. How's this one doing? You're full too? Alright, take you off as well. And I'll replace these miners over here. I've got seven, but I need more than that. I need... We should need something like... Oh, we're going to need a lot more than that. Uh, wait, one, two, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We've got nine, so we've got eighteen for 24 furnaces. I don't think that's enough. And indeed, it is not enough, but the belts, I think, are too slow. Which is not great. Not a happy eventuality. Three. Let's get three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. Alright, let me grab some more miners from the mall. So we can get stuff going on. I need some green chips. Let's just take them from the box. Okay, thank you very much. All right. Get all the miners. Well, there's 14 in there, which is not bad. What are you lacking? You're lacking gears. Really? Is there a gear problem? Oh, there is a gear problem. Because there's an iron problem. <laughs> Dear me. All right. Sounds like some more... A little bit of pocket crafting. I really just need to get the iron up. That's what I need to do. Um, right. Oh gosh, look at what I, look what I've done. I have. I was supposed to get coal going on, and now I've gotten distracted entirely by all these miners. Let's go. How many did I have here again? I forgot. Nine. Um, let's see if nine will work. Or ten. Look at our okay. Let's get this 
along here so we can go into the next array for smelting and let's see let it run a bit and are these miners stopping we actually might need to get some red belt going um, to move these things along a bit because it looks like well it looks like 10 yeah it looks like it's working we can add possibly one Let's see how much was this this was 10 oops and nine all right so I'm gonna add one more miner here see if that'll work a little bit better all right great also stand to have a little bit of light around here goodness me it's dark whoa these guys haven't had inserters oh whoops that was my bad goodness me that's not great okay come on gears gears we need gears Look at all these blueprints. Oh, I, I'm gonna put them into a box. I'm gonna shove them down here. I feel like I have way too many of them. Um, let's take that out. I have one. I only need one, really. Otherwise, I'm I'm good with that. I think I will also get these belts that way. And then we need to hook up the second copper. Um, okay, you're missing this. There we go. All the rest of them are good. All right, excellent. Let's make sure we connect up this copper thingy here. Okay. Perfect. Right he oh um yeah we need to get some balancing first because we don't have this balancer there yet so we're gonna put it over here I think now oh that's right I was gonna put it down here as I recall because otherwise we're gonna have to have some snaking going around yeah it's okay we'll 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 get these problems sorted out one two three four five okay we'll sort out the problems when we actually get to them okay perfect that's what we want and get this second copper line moved down here get this there just in case we should need it right nice now have I gotten I have a couple more grenades made <laughs> I do need to make more oh my goodness let's get uh, I'm gonna grab some more coal just get these done I should have been doing that the whole time. I don't know why I didn't. It's very silly of me. Still need coal. The, f the ironic thing is, of course, that I'm going to be setting up machines that are going to take these things. Um, so, yeah. It's, it's funky the way the life works. And things work and stuff. Oops. I don't need that one, but I do need these. And these. Oops. Goodness me. Come on, sloppy hands. There we go. I'm not really sure how many assemblers I should make, but I have kind of looked at the ratios of them and stuff like this, and it's kind of funky. Um, we're making, let's see. Let's see if we can, I don't, you know, I don't even know if we'll need that many things. We are we gonna need military a lot. Eh, I guess we'll need plenty of it. Uh, so right now we're making how many of these? Making one science pack every six seconds. So we've got two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. So in six seconds we will be making twelve. So that's about two every second 
um, which is, eh, that's going to be interesting to translate into the military stuff, um, as you will see. Let's get some of this stuff moved. Trees, get upgraded. Yeah, the cry of SpaceX, right? I really, you know what I should get? I should get grenade damage. Well, I guess I could if I, if I had, if I had the science for it. All right, we're gonna get grenade damage very shortly. In the meantime, let's do something. You know, bullet shooting speed. I don't care at this point. We'll just have something going in here. I think I'd like to. Let's do this. Have this going this way. And we'll make our science packs over here. <sighs> right. Um, so these military science packs are gray, which is a fair fitting color, I suppose. They need three different materials. So that means they're gonna need two in belts. Let's put them here like this. I need two belts to come in with. And then, oh, I should get, um, let's get upgraded machines from the mall real quick. I hope there are some. I built a few of those, uh, you know, level one machines because of, uh, how much were there? 16? It's not enough. It's not enough. No. All right. I'm going to get the others. Make four. What am I missing? Iron again. All right. Yes. They should rename this mode to always short of iron run. <laughs> Okay. All right. We'll get this. And I think between episodes, I'm going to work on doing some of the iron mining and such. Right. Um, here we go. So these things, let's look at them real quick. They are costing, they take 10 seconds to make. So if we want two every second, we're going to need 20 of these machines. I don't think I want to make 20 of them. <laughs> I can make 10, um, but I don't want to make 20. Let's see, let's see, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Because we're not going to be doing military science for that much, that much military science. So I'm just tempted to say, you know, no, we're not going to do this. All right, and copy and walk paste all the way down. Ooh, okay, still have paste range. Okay. Can we, actually we can do this way. Do, do, do. Wait, I forgot how, oh, that's how it goes, sorry. Go this one and that one. If you hear funny noises in the background, that's my cat snoring. It's Magnolia. She's uh, <laughs> she has a bit of a cold, so she's just kind of like hanging out, kind of snoring a bit. There, are, all three of them are on the window right now, which is really cute. Um, they're all getting along quite beautifully. Maggie initially had a lot of trouble adapting to having other cats that she's not familiar with uh, in the family. So I'm really happy that she's quite happy now with other uh, critters in the house. So I think there was some amount of jealousy going on there. Okay, let's get those things. Oh my gosh, she's getting quite loud now. Okay. So we have inserters, hooray. Um, and we're gonna get some output on the other side. Oops, I forgot to put in one of these guys. Nice. All right, and we'll get our belt extended that way. And here's where we'll have our military science come down. Uh, and go here. So how do we get enough stuff for this military science? Well, that's going to be an interesting problem, I think. Let's get these going here. Oh, 
The question is, where do we want to make this stuff? I think we can make it. Um, yeah, and I feel like I didn't leave enough space on the this side for that. But I could make it here. I want to leave space for the other assemblers, for other sciences to go there. Uh, so I think we can just actually pull this through this way. And then this is going to need, let's assume two belts for that. Oh, and we need more grenades. We'll just kind of take this along this way. God, whoops. <laughs> All right. So, oh my goodness. Science is very complicated. So for uh, purple science, or not purple, gray science, military science. Oh, oh, and by the way, these, oh, 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 I've miscalculated. Look at that. So these actually make two science packs per machine per craft. So we have equivalent of 20 there, or one per second. Um, okay, get, get, just get stuff research. Just do things, please. Don't interrupt me. Um, but let's make sure that we have enough to get all of these things. So we're going to need... Uh, to get uh, piercing rounds. We're going to have, uh, we're probably, let's see, piercing rounds. We need one every 10 seconds. And these take three seconds to make. So making one item every second is actually quite convenient for us because all we need to do is look at the crafting time of this and this is three seconds to craft. And so if you want one per second, you just put down three machines. Um, it makes it quite, quite simple. Um, so let's see, these need, oh, okay. Well, let's, uh... oh, wait, that's not it. That's not what we want. We're gonna have our other stuff. Oh, I don't know what to pick. Just, just something. Just leave me alone. <laughs> I don't want your stuff. Uh, okay. So let's, uh, we might have to rearrange some of this stuff uh, because I want to look at the chains of stuff. Okay. We need iron plates, steel, and copper to make all of these things. All right. So we're going to need another two belts here. The first stage is going to be making these firearm magazines. How many do we need? We just need one firearm magazine uh, per each of these guys. So we're going to need just one. These make one every second. We need one every three seconds. So that's just fine. We'll put this one here. Uh, and that's going to put, oh, we can actually put that back on the line right there. Uh, and then we're going to get our other stuff going. Wait, railway. Yeah, that's fine. I think I'm going to leave a space for another one just to expand it a little bit if we want to. But we're going to need three of these machines. One, two, three. And I think I can put a light somewhere. Eh, well, maybe not anywhere at the moment. Okay, so we're going to need these guys. They're going to need stuff. And these guys are going to output onto a belt, of course. All right, let's connect this with the rest of the world and possibly get a light or two in here. It is very dark. Goodness me. Okay, there's something. Some light to look forward to. Yay. And I suppose I should get these guys sorted out. Because we're going to need... Um, we're going to need iron on these. Are these are going to need just that stuff. Okay. Ooh, mining productivity one. Ooh, plus 2%. I'll take it. I will take it. Oh, there's a suggested tutorial. Now this is new in the game. I know you guys were, were kind of, <laughs> um, annoyed, I guess, at me with, uh, saying that those tips and tricks are new. Yeah, I have not played the beginning of the game, like from the demo version for a very, very long time. So forgive me on that. I did forget that those were already in the game. Um, 
but these tutorial things are actually new. I remember them talking about building those. Okay, let's get these. Hopefully don't kill my belt. Very nice. So we're gonna need steel and copper. So let's get steel down here. And copper. Could walk on top of the belt, that might be faster. Right, um I'm gonna get this to be right here because this thing is gonna need to be like this. And I don't want oops that to go there. Okay. Okay, and there's a reason I'm doing it this way. I want it on this side of the belt so that the ammo can be put on the other side. Now the other one, we're gonna need to have steel and copper coming along. Oopsie, one too early. Okay, very nice, oopsie. Oh, I ran out of undergrounds. Shoot. Let's grab some from the mall. How are we for... Uh, we have no un uh, inserters. Let's grab these. Oh, three. Aw, oh, come on, game. Yeah, it's these, uh, these gears. For some reason, they're not getting a lot of plates, and I don't know why. They're just very, very slowly getting stuff. Okay. Let's keep on going down. I'll bring some of these other belts down while I'm here. Because I think we're going to need... What are we going to need? We're going to need turrets. And we're going to need... Grenades need coal. So let's just bring the coal down. As we're coming down here. So we're going to get our steel... Okay, so this one, perfect, very nice, okay, get rid of this very poor looking little tree, okay, so we should have one material made, nice, mm, and what are we missing, we're just missing the steel, perfect, and that will be coming along here. I don't think it matters which side. We're pretty good on that. Let's get trains going. Next thing is going to be grenades. So we're gonna need quite a few grenade makers. We're gonna need eight of them to, to keep up with this. Can I make grenades? Where, where are they? Right there. Okay, I just didn't see them. Uh, wow, we're gonna need iron and coal. So I'll just put these down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And we'll get our inserters. There we are. Okay, we're looking at iron and coal again. I almost forgot what we needed. Oh, jeez. So much wood chopping right before the end. Ah, oh, we almost have them made. Okay, come on, let's get some of this coal, get stuff made. Man, oh man, what a misery. Okay, let's get all of the train stuff going on. Yay, train stops and train schedules. I'm going to look through this and see if it's, if it's uh, hopefully it's useful. I am actually planning on doing some tutorials. So many people have asked me for train tutorials um, and other tutorials for the game. So I'm happy to, to do those now that we finally have HD graphics and most of the stuff. Um, I feel like I'm kind of comfortable doing that where I wouldn't have to redo them if we had, you know, better graphics come out or something like that. I mean, I know all the HD graphics are not in the game just yet, um, but this is 
good enough, I think. Okay, let's do... Uh, whoops. Yep, that was not supposed to be there. Okay, and this one needs to be coal. Come on, Cole. Come with me. You know what I could do? Could get a blueprint of this whole silliness. All of these things. So I don't have to remember how far each of these guys is apart. That's the only thing that I find a little bit annoying about. Um this is that you kind of have to know how far you're going before you're even getting there. And since we don't have an actual grid to count on, it's a little bit um, hard to judge sometimes. But we have these free blueprints now, which is very, very nice. So glad for that. Get rid of these trees. Okay, and we have only one more item to make. I am aware I am running severely over time, but I really wanted to get these things done. Oops, wait. Uh, we might have other stuff coming in here. Mining productivity too. I'll take it. Yes, please. Oh, advanced rail signals. That sounds very promising. So gun turrets, what do we need for these? We need um, iron plates, copper and gears. Mm. Wow, and we need a ton of them. We need eight machines with stuff in them. <sighs> wow. That's a lot of gears. Um, I'm tempted to do like three belts of iron, to be honest. Because I need 20. Well, actually, they do have a long crafting time. So we'll just do one for now. Or you know what I'll do? We need to have a full belt of iron. Oh, we can do that. We can do a full belt of iron. Uh, and then half a belt of gears and um, copper. So let's uh, add that to our happy state of affairs. Should I put it that close though? Eh, I probably shouldn't. I should probably put it out here. Give ourselves room. Why are we just not doing this? I'm going to put the copper or the gears. I mean the gears. I'm going to put the things on the inside the iron on the inside so that we'll have less trouble with the gears, construction and things like that. Let's try to get these. Oh my god, my my poor. Ha! <laughs> I'll wait till we have robots to figure that out. I don't really want to repair it at the moment. I thought it was far enough, but oh well. Okay. Um I'm gonna need copper. So copper is going to come in on the underside of this thing. So we could do this. Have copper do this sort of thing like that. So it gets on that side of the belt where we want it. Okay. And again, we're going to need eight machines. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, but one of them... Let's see, how many gears can we make in eight seconds? How many do we need in eight seconds? Here's gears. Okay, we can make in eight seconds, we can make 16 gears. So, what do we think about this? Um, we need 10 every eight seconds. <laughs> so we need one gear maker. Um, wow. We, we, uh, the meow is real. Uh, you almost need a gear maker every two machines or a little bit more than that. Eeps. I feel like, should we bother doing this? I'm almost thinking that um, I want to just do direct feed of gears instead. Something like this, where we go gears here in the middle, and then we have these gun turrets here and here. And that's, we're going to be four gears short all the time. But, 
It might be worth it. I don't know. Because it does need an awful lot of gears. I could even put in more gears on that other, or more iron on that other thing. Let's see, how is this going to be hanging with us? Are you going to like this? Oh, let's get our belt going through here like this and see. We can use just regular inserters to output. Actually, we'll put them here because we're going to have the other sets there. Oh, I have no more poles. I should probably make some. I'm gonna get the science out of my pocket as well. Okay, here we go with this. Okay. Should put it on this side. Yeah, that'll be fine. So, how you doing, machines? Are you outputting anything yet? No, because I forgot to give you inserters. Sorry. But I think this might be a decent setup. I'm gonna have to look at this. Okay, there it goes. The gear maker is working again, most well, sometimes, if it has enough iron, which it doesn't. Hmm. Well, this should be almost right. I think it's right enough for me. I'm just going to go with that. But we are going to need probably fast belts here. And other stuff. So this is going to be, what, four? We need eight. Ugh. That's okay. We are adventurous. We are exploring new science. And we're, we're happy about it, mostly. Sort of. Okay. Let's put this, that, that's going to be eight, right? Let's see, two, four, six, and eight. Okay, I will finish building this in between episodes, and uh, I will see you in the next one. So thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.